Blue Coats Media Danny upstairs here in the Willington Delaware Fieldhouse, and we're now joined by the brother of Tobias Harris, Terry Harris. You know what I did in college? I could do at the, you know, the professional level. But they had to shoot it at a high percentage from three, and so if I could do that and show I could do it on this level, I'll be, you know, one of my goals. Terry, Xavier, huh? since being in Philly, um, have you been able to try any uh, cheesesteak places? And if so, what's your favorite one? Oh, oh yeah. That place is fire. Yeah. Terry, Jake Schwartz, Voice of Reason, how are you doing? It's Very great to doing. see you as always. And first of all, it's uh, I go back to the days when you were playing at the Very Clyde Classic uh, right. with our good friend Alex. Uh, tell us about, first of all, you, you and your brother are both basically part of the same organization. Did you ever... I guess wake up one day and just think, me and my brother, we'd be both be playing for the same team and basically being able to live not too far where our parents could come and watch us play every day. I, I haven't really like sat and thought about it like that, but uh, you know, you saying that kind of, you know, it been, uh, brings me a little chills. Like it is a great, it is great, and it's something that, um, it's something that you know, it's not, uh, and I don't look at every day, but. Um, you know, when I do appreciate it, it's just like I got my brother with me, uh, and you know he's always, you know, giving me ways to achieve at the next level. So, you know, I feel like I'm in a great situation, and I just uh, thank God every day to be in this situation where I can be close to him. And for you, Xavier, what's the one thing you're going to be looking forward to as you take the floor against Maine on Saturday night? Go out there, have fun, get a win. Uh, stick to our culture of basketball that we're trying to instill here. Um, go out there, just have fun and. Hopefully, it's a good crowd and it'll be a great atmosphere. Terry, in college, you played in a system where you used a lot of a lot of players. How tough was that to kind of get your rhythm when the minutes were divided up that way? Uh, I'm, yeah, it definitely is tough uh, on the rotations. Uh, you know, expanding and, and with a lot of players, like you said. But um, I think that uh, you know, going into the next level, I can only take things from that. Uh, you know, learning how to maximize. Being the best out of using the best of the minutes I use. So, whether I'm at this level right now, if I'm not getting those minutes, uh, still learning, using, you know, figuring out how to maximize my minutes and being productive in the time I get. Your other brother also played uh, like yourself out in Las Vegas. So, there were th three of you out there. Uh, I had the chance to do the Euro Summer Basketball League, and I met your. Your brother, uh, I believe it was uh, Tyler. Yeah. Uh, one of the things I learned about him was his uh, handle. Do you feel like uh, he and Tobias kind of like share that? Because uh, I know you're more of the guard type player. Do you feel like they share kind of the same type of uh, position? Uh, a little bit. I think everyone has. I think all brothers, all of us have uh, <laughs> all of our own different strengths in the court. You know, Tobias more versatile. Tyler, uh, one of the great finishers around the basket. And me and my shooting. So, uh I think we all have our own little different niches through our games, and uh, you know when we come together, I think we can all learn from each other. You still, you and Tobias still one on one a lot? Or? Yeah, we do. Yeah, he gets the best out of me. I'm not gonna lie, but you know, I'm young still. I got a couple. He got a couple years ahead of me, and uh, you know maybe one day I'll catch him. He's got a little height on you. He, he, he might try to post you up a little yeah, bit. Yeah, no, he does. I know there's an old saying, uh, Terry, that uh, you know don't be the next be the first you. What is Terry Harris trying to do when he takes the floor this Saturday night? Uh, just show what Terry Harris can do and, uh, you know, whether it be, uh, you know, I think I'm a knockdown elite shooter. I want to be able to show that I could do that on the NBA level. So uh, that's what I'm trying to prove on this level that what I can do. Who's the best shooter out of three of you? Because I think Tobias is not just that he's here. Same answer. I'm sure we go. <laughs> Who is? I'm sorry. Terry Harris. Leave <laughs> you. Dwayne Gain is. Uh, By the way, that's going to go back. That's going to get back to the bias. So I'll have to yeah. see what he says about it. Well, this is for both of you guys, Terry and Xavier. What goals have you set for yourself for the season? Uh, my main Either goal one is just to come out here and just, just, have, just have fun, get back to having fun, playing basketball. Uh, last year I was in China. Uh, it was kind of a different situation, and I really didn't have fun. So I, I really want to get back to just having fun, and that's when I'm at my best. Uh, I think for me, it's just to learn as much as I can, uh, gain as much experience, learn from the older guys like Epps, and just uh, use this as a, you know, my first year in the professional level to, you know, get better, gain a better mindset, and just uh, 
being better, getting myself better, basketball skill on the court as well. So you just said that you were the better shooter out of the family, out of the bunch. Do you call Tobias for any other tips as far as him playing at the pro level? Oh, everything. I mean, I ask him for anything, any type of advice. You know, that's my big brother, that's my role model. So, you know, even on the court and off the court type of stuff, you know, we talk about anything. So, Who's the best uh, be, between the two of you? Uh, the, the probably the best guard that's really uh, a, a, a player overall that's really stood out here at training camp for for the for the for the both of you besides yourself of course has Shiz Austin been like or you know I know Zaire's still working through a rehab but like someone like has has Shiz impressed here at, at camp has Zaire um, yeah, I think every, I think I, I think I've been surprised by almost like all, everybody. So uh, you know, everyone's been playing to their best abilities out here today. I, I mean, this whole training camp, and uh, you know, I like to see um, everyone. You know, you can tell everyone's been working hard this whole summer and has been gaining, uh, uh, showing improvement on their skill level. So I mean, I think everyone really stood out to me. Xavier, what did you take from your experience in China that's going to fuel your performance?